G'day and welcome to the Tech Math Channel. In this video today, what we're going to be having a look at is the fast way of multiplying two two digit numbers together. So let's go. So, first of all, we'll see if we can multiply some numbers together. I'll give you a question here which is 21 times 31. I'll give you ah, six, seven seconds to work that out. Go. So, time's up. Now, if you got the answer is 651, you did really, really well. You got the right answer. If you were busily reaching for the calculator but couldn't find it in time, well, bad luck. You shouldn't need a calculator because I'm going to show you how you can work it out that quickly. Okay? So don't don't get all despondent if you didn't work it out. We'll go through that right now. So I'll show you how to work these out. So to get the first number of our answer, we multiply the first digits in our, in our two numbers here. So 2 times 3 is 6. There you go. We've got the first part of our answer. We leave a blank space. And then... To get the last number of our answer, we multiply the last digits of our two numbers here. So 1 times 1 is 1. Alright, now to get this middle number here, there's a bit of a trick with this. And to do this, what we do is we multiply this number and this number, this number and this number, and we add the answer together. So 1 times 2 is 2, 1 times 3 is 3. We add 2 and 3 together, we get the answer 651. Hey, pretty easy, eh? Oh, we'll have a look at another one. So, what about uh, 43 times 21? A little bit harder this time. See how you go. Have you got the answer yet? Okay, I'll, I'll start working through this one. So again, 4 times 2 is 8. We leave the blank space. 1 times 3, 3. Then what we do is we go... You remember this? 1 times 4, we add that to 3 times 2. So 1 times 4 is 4, 3 times 2 is 6. We add these together, and we get the answer of 10. Now this leads to a bit of a problem here, and this is a little bit of a trick that you, you, you probably want to get. This space here is only one space. It only has space to fit one digit in. Okay, So the digit that it actually puts in out of this 10 is the 0 here. We put the 0 there, and this 1 here we carry across. Okay, and We add it on. So the answer we end up getting is 1 plus 8 is 903. Oh, well, good. Hey, I reckon we can go through one more. Okay, so I'll rub that out. Let's have a look at one more question. I think this time I'm going to do it in a nice, uh, this sort of purpley sort of colour. And I'll do the question here 42 times. 63. I'm going all out and using different colours today. Getting excited. Go for it. Ah, I'm getting too excited. I can't even wait to get the answer here. Let's just start working it out. So I get the first number. 4 times 6 is 24. Leave our space. <laughs> 2 times 3 is 6. And then what we'll do, and I hope I don't do because I've had to remake this video because I, I stuffed up the answer on this one. I'll be honest on this one. Occasionally I, I, I get all excited and I, I do actually make mistakes too. But for YouTube videos, we don't make mistakes. We always get it 100% correct, like, like you guys do, okay? But, okay, we multiply these two guys together. 4 times 3 is 12, 6 times 2 is 12, and so 12 plus 12 is 24. We're going to add 24 on. All right, so there's a... 4 there and a 2 there. Alright, what answer did we get? We get the answer of 2,646. Hey, that's the right answer. Pretty cool, right? Okay, so if you practice these, you'll get, you'll get really, really good at them, you get really, really fast. Your teacher will be utterly astounded about how great you are. Hey, I know half of you guys probably aren't even going to school, but everyone will be astounded how you guys. People think you're a genius, alright? You don't want to push around too much, people might stop talking to you and that sort of deal because I think you're too smart. But hey, you do this, you'll do really, really well. And yes, you will make a few mistakes. We all make mistakes. So what I'm going to leave you with lastly is I'm going to leave you with a couple of questions. I'll write them up. I'll get you to pause it, work through them, and then I'll work through the answers as quick as I can. Okay, so here they are. So 22 times 34, ah, 32, hey, see how you go on that one. What about 51 times 63? And what about 82, uh, say, times 51? So, pause the video, 
then I'll get back to you in you know, a couple of seconds and we'll, we'll go through these. All right, so hopefully you've worked through those. We'll work through the answer to these right now, okay? So two times three is six, and we leave that blank space. Uh, two times two is four, and then we add four and six together, which is 10. So we're gonna get the answer of 704, okay? There's our answer. The next one, five times six is 30. Leave a space. 1 times 3 is 3. And then we're going to get the, the number we're going to put in there is going to be 3 times 5, which is 15. 1 times 6, which is 6. 15 plus 6 is 21. So I'll put that in a different color so it fits. And it's going to go a 1. And this is going to end up being a 2. So our answer is going to be 3,213. Okay, the very last one. 5 times 8 is 40. Leave a blank space. 1 times 2 is 2. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go 1 times 8, and we're going to add that to 10. 8 plus 10 is 18. So how am I going to put 18 in here? We'll put the 8 there, and the 1's going to go there. So our answer is going to be 4,182. I hope you do well on those. I'll see you next time.